Good afternoon, Nelson Mandela University staff and students. We, as we all know, we are dealing with this uh, coronavirus um, pandemic. It is difficult times for our institution, for our country, and for the rest of the world. As of uh, yesterday, the cases that are reported in South Africa are still sitting at 116 cases. As Nelson Mandela University, our staff and students are our top priority. Nelson Mandela University has set up a dedicated website on the coronavirus and in this website you will find information pertaining as to how you deal uh, with the virus and one of the things you'll find on the website are toll-free numbers, the NICD dedicated toll-free numbers and you will also find frequently asked questions and you can ask questions as well and the university will respond to your question. You'll also find information on travel on the website and what you do when you return from international travel. It must be noted that the university has banned all international travel and has stated clearly that travel locally or domestic travel must be limited uh, and it must be absolutely necessary for anyone to travel. And look. As we are all aware that this is a national disaster and has been declared so by the President, Cyril Ramaphosa, we therefore encourage uh, individuals to disperse. We do not encourage any gatherings as an institution. As such, we do encourage that students must vacate residences because uh, as, a, as a city that is not affected by this virus at this stage, we therefore want to break the chain of spread of the virus and as such we encourage students to travel back home rather than being concentrated in residences which might become concentration camps. The other aspect of things is that should we have contacts of this virus and the students are the most vulnerable community when it comes to that and then we have to lock down come to lockdown or come to a complete shutdown, it will be very difficult to offer services to the vulnerable group of students that will be in residences when we lock down. As all staff members and other students that have gone home will be staying behind closed doors in their homes. Most importantly, we need to contain this virus and flatten the curve of the exponential rise on the transmission rates of this virus. We must know that then the mortality rate is extremely high with this virus and therefore one needs to break the chain of spread and the only way that we can do that is to contain the spread of the virus and that we can do by dispersing, by reducing gatherings to absolute minimum as suggested and by maintaining the social distance as being suggested. Thank you.